Hi everyone. Well, you're watching Just So Random. We just went to Walmart and got Janice's last basket for her display. Um, and potatoes. We got potatoes. And potatoes. Um, we eat a lot we, of potatoes. We do eat a lot of potatoes. We are going to Giant Eagle to get a few things. Because uh, Janice is cooking a pot roast, right? Well, I'm going to... Um, I got, pulled, this, big, I got gonna this make, big old pork roast I'm going to make out of... I'm going to make pulled pork out of. I'm gonna stick it in the crock pot. It should be done tonight, so. I got supper. But, um, uh, I'm letting Janice experience the metal. We're listening to Arch Enemy. We had a discussion about that last night. Mm -hmm. So we're listening to Arch Enemy. She's enjoying it so far. How are you, how are you liking it? See, she's not shaking her head. Like, she's like, yeah, she's really into it. She likes it. Um, and then I'm going to trade uh, a controller in at GameStop, even though I don't like GameStop. But I want to pre-order Elder Scrolls so I can get the content that they took out of the game to make it a pre-order. What exactly is Elder Scrolls? She doesn't know what Elder Scrolls what the hell is it? It's like Skyrim. It, I mean, like Elder Scrolls Skyrim and Elder Scrolls Oblivion and it's all Elder Scrolls. This is the. Um, so Skyrim is Elder Scrolls. Yeah. This is the MMO RPG of Elder Scrolls, and it has like all of Tamriel and, and everything. And you can be like any race and. It's so and, Yeah, it is, but I like it. Um, but uh, so it's gonna be like World of Warcraft, but like first person. In oh, Elder Scrolls it. world. What is this person doing? See, this motherfucker's going in. Um, I know. And making me stop in the middle that's of That's what I mean. Street. I mean, what does this guy do? Anyways, yeah, so it's going to be like an MMO RPG. You know, it's going to be fun. But I want the pre order because you get like the Explorer pack, which allows you to um, uh, you use. Oh, wait, you can be like any race. You can use any race to join any clan or something like that. And to me, that sounds like something that should just come with the game, but they took it out of it to make a pre-order bonus, which I hate pre-ordering. And what's pre-ordering, Janice? Pre-ordering is just a big dick in your mouth. It is? Yep. Where'd you learn that? South Park. When they're talking about making sure that you pre-order the games and stuff. I don't remember that. In the console wars? I don't remember. I, rem I just remember console rules, I don't remember that. Them talking about pre-ordering. Yeah, pre-ordering is just a big dick in the mouth. The only thing Council Wars is giving money for something that you can't have until it comes out. It's a big dick in your mouth. I hate it. I hate DLC. I, I don't hate DLC. I hate like this day one DLC bullshit and these uh, freemium games that fucking uh, pay to play shit and microtransactions. I hate all that. If you want to give me new characters, if you want to give me new, uh, new levels, if you want to give me new weapons, that's fine. As long as it's new, not if it's like, oh, hey, we took this out of the original game so that you can get it on day one. It's pretty stupid. Anything else to add before we um, continue our journey down the road here and listen to some arch enemy? Help me. Never. I got an ideal image, too. I get some latest hair removal. Really just good, little, good to know. Good to um, So we just went to Burger King and Janice was doing her famous scamming. She, uh, we got like a Whopper and chicken nuggets and, and split them. But she walked up to the manager and was like, oh, the other day uh, we came through the drive-thru and they forgot our large fry and they said they were putting us in the book or something. And the lady just went, oh, it's just a fry? Okay. And she put it in the thing for us. So there's Denise scamming and getting away with it. Not scamming. It's leading somebody to where you want them to go and the, them going. Sounds like con artist. <laughs> um, but I told Denise that I want to get her this license plate that says scamming and the S will be a dollar sign. And, so and then, get pulled over all the time. And that'll be her vanity license plate that I get for her. No, if um, I get one, you gotta get one. So it's gonna we, be scamming one and scamming two. We went to Giant Eagle 
to get this gift card um, turned into cash because they do a thing here like that. And um, the, machine. the machine was down, so now we got to go to the Talmadge. That's not the far away. Talmadge. I the street. Ben Eagle, they yeah. said that they have one there. Hopefully that one's working. And there's Target. Look at the, the greatest place in the world. I love that place. Do you love it, Janice? It's Isn't Target okay. amazing? Target is amazing. Okay, I like it a lot. So, um, we used the thing at Giant Eagle to get the gift card. We had like $42 on this gift card. And they said we could have $29.82. So, like, it took like $12 just to use this thing but I mean like we need money for gas and stuff like if Walmart had gas we'd be fine yeah but, but we needed some gas well, it's so good we don't have Sam Club membership. yeah that would have been good too but um but yeah so that thing is I don't know it's kind of a ripoff but maybe it's like more of uh um, is this a percentage that's a fucked up percentage yeah if it's a percentage it's, yeah it is pretty hot but I don't think it is. I think it's like a fee. So it might be if you have like more money, you know, like a hundred dollar gift card, it might be more beneficial to you. But uh, we learned the hard way that they don't take a Hot Topic gift card. And Shanice had one. We're gonna put that in there. Um, but and it got stuck in the in the thing. And um, like it got so stuck in there that like. Uh, she was calling like the service guy and stuff and we couldn't get it out with like pliers or nothing so like I was thinking of Fallout I like I played enough Fallout well actually more Dying Light than Fallout because in Fallout you use bobby pin and Dying Light you use paper clips I asked the guy for a paper clip and he gave me a paper clip and I extended like one arm out of it and I used my knife and I pried it up with my knife and stuck the paper clip in and pulled it out like a pair of uh, pliers. So video games do pay off, kids. Remember that when somebody tells you you're wasting your time playing video games. They they are a little beneficial sometimes, so just remember that. She does. So I, I just went to the uh, uh, place that shall not be named, GameStop. I fucking hate them. But fortunately for me, I didn't know they were doing this. I got an extra 50% on my um, uh, trade-in, trade you know. So I was able to get like 20 bucks for the for my controller I, I, I uh, turned in. Uh, but they charged me a $2 refurbish fee for the uh, small chips on um, uh, around the, the joysticks were. And that was from winning multiple UFC champions. Um, It'll show them when they realize the motherfucker don't work. Yeah, it doesn't work anyways. It doesn't work. But I can tell you from working at GameStop, all they're gonna do, they're not gonna fix it up, and they're gonna send it to a warehouse. Anyways, um, but I was able to get the pre-order bonus for Elder Scrolls, which was really pissed me off. I mean, when I heard about this, it's, it's any race, any class is what you get to do. That should be a given. Like any other Elder Scrolls it wasn't like oh elves can only be rangers and oh you want to be a barbarian you have to be a nord it was never like that never ever that I know of so I don't know why they're doing it now but oh and I did find out you get a pet so that's going to be fucking game stop <sighs> I hate pre-orders but I was just happy that I got damn near 20 bucks for that controller so that was pretty cool I thought I'd get like seven dollars with GameStop. Anything to add, baby? No. That's my rant for now. Talk to you later. All right, guys. Um, technically it's the next day. It's like six o'clock in the morning. I just took. It is six o'clock in the morning. It's like six o two. Um, I just uh dropped Jeff off at work, and I'm about to go back to sleep until probably about. Probably about 10. 10.30. Huh. Excuse me. I have an appointment for my pip. Uh, 
at 12 so I got all my papers ready for that I just gotta get one thing signed by my mom and that'll be that and I go get that taken care of finally I need to check the bank account make sure that I got paid though I'm about to do that um but I forgot to say goodnight last night uh we got home probably like yesterday we got home probably about 4 30 and yeah probably about 4 30 and I uh Jeff cut the um cut the bone out of the roast for me and had him do that it was interesting uh and put that on the crock pot and it took it didn't get done it didn't get like eatable probably until like because uh, I want it pulled pork so that means the connective tissue has to break down and that took about six hours on high in my crock pot but it's really good so yay for that um I made I made uh all four batches of body butters so I have uh just a unscented one I have honeysuckle I have love spell and I have what else is it oh and I have cucumber melon so maybe I should make some cucumber melon bath bombs to go with that I think I will so I'm making three bath or bath bombs because the only thing I have to do today is label everything is label um is label the jars and shrink wrap them so after I and uh, make uh, my uh, scrubs, so my emulsify sugar and salt scrubs. That's what I'm making. Um, but yeah, I just want to say, I was guys, what was up? So um, I'm going to say good night because I am going. I am going to go back to sleep. So uh, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, favorite, check out any one of the multiple social media links down below. Check out any one of the links down below. Uh, don't forget to check out RubberCitySoaps.com or Rubber City Soaps Facebook. I will have everything. I will be taking stock photos of everything tomorrow and shrink wrapping mostly everything tomorrow. Well, not mostly everything. Well, I think I'm going to uh, try to get everything done and shrink wrapped probably either tomorrow or Friday. But I want to take stock pictures, stock photos, like, as soon as possible. So, I might do it tomorrow. Um, but other than that, uh, like I said, check out RiverCitySoaps.com or the Facebook. Because everything will be up soon, I promise. But, yeah. Um, I'm going to say goodnight. Goodnight. Tink is sleeping in my chair. So, goodnight from her. And, um... <laughs> I will talk to you guys tomorrow, or technically that will be later today. Night.